Tonight, romance breaks out in the Big Brother house. After four days, feeding the chickens has become a morning routine, but not for everybody. Another routine the housemates are getting used to is the one-hour hot water supply. Yesterday, they showered two at a time. Today, it's three. Peter is learning what Back to Basics is all about. Whack it across that. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do those in a sec. I'll just <coughs> rinse. Has this view coloured this or this was white? What was it? was white, I think. What's that? Oh, it's, it's already there. It's already there. Okay. Yeah. Mashed banana, mashed avocado, and some of this. What is it? It's a Brazilian cereal. Oh, you bought it yourself? Yeah. Shana, huh? Have a taste. Yeah. Oh, it's like oats. I mean, it's like. Mm. I don't know what it's like. Mm. Oh, it's nice. Can't read what's in it. It looks like chaff, like something you'd feed your horses. Yeah, That's I'm a horse. Hello? Where's all your food? My favourite movie is Ace and Charles. I have how many siblings? Oh, it's not Zero. really. It's the only one I can think of. I can change my mind. I would be a robber. The housemates are practising the weekly task set by Big Brother. They have to remember three things about each other, and tonight, they'll be tested. They bet 25% of their weekly budget that they'd pass with less than two mistakes. That's all right. Favourite body part? Yeah. Legs. If his house is burning down, and he's shaving sometimes. Favourite part of his body? That's why I was like, Cap in his teeth. <laughs> what would he take from his house? Ooh. Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that. I'm with you. Got it. Mm. Golf club? I mean, nothing to you, do I? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, no, no, no. How many eggs did we get this morning? Oh, well, we got another five. So. Too much. Oh, you're kidding. If that was online. If, if, if. Ah, yes. And if I was a millionaire, I wouldn't be here. <laughs> yes, you would. No. It blew from down here. Ben Ralph does a morning Ralph reading of the William the Golding classic, Lord of the Flies. It reminds the group of the strange world they've been placed in. Under the palms. Clouds of birds rose from the treetops and something squealed and ran into the undergrowth. Ralph took the shell away from his lips. Gosh, his ordinary voice sounded like a whisper after the harsh note of the conch. All this grooming. Wow, like monkeys in the forest. Monkeys That's what in we are. Enclosures. And before you know it, we'll be squeezing, squeezing each other's pimples. Yeah. I squeeze anyone's zits, whether or normal or not. That's a fetish of yours, yours yeah. though, isn't it, Sarah? Yeah, cutting that in volleyball. Yeah. Think, think, think. Peter's favourite movie. Hey, it's Peter. <laughs> <laughs>
Peter has asked Gemma to demonstrate some of her skills as a makeup artist. I could not add up how many houses I've lived in. Really? Uh, I've always, although I've always lived in the city, I've always, my dad was a horse trainer for years, so we lived um, near 10 acres of land and they're from the country. And I think it's just really, it's a nice sort of influence to have in your life. It's, mm. sort of, it's quite... Especially for young kids. Uh, I think so. I mean, I probably would just because of my lifestyle. But like, I would rather bring kids up in the country and then move back to the city with them. Yeah. Because kids in primary school in the city, it's just dangerous. People grabbing them and kidnapping them. Oh, yeah. Well, that's what panicked me about. Like, when I started to get worried about living in, in England, you know, like, because I was going down could have been going down that track with my ex because yeah. we'd been together for so long and it was obviously would be I guess a natural progression at the yeah. end but I just couldn't see myself bringing up kids in England in England After days of practice, it's time for the group to be tested on their first weekly task. OK. Um, success for these week's challenges depends on how well you have gotten to know each other since moving into the Big Brother house. The test will be issued as follows. Big Brother will shortly reopen the storeroom. In there you will find a plasma screen TV, operating instructions and a plan showing you where to place it. Once the screen is set up and turned on, all the housemates are to gather on the lounge chairs and wait to be individually called to the diary room by Big Brother to be tested. Oh, we get the watch. Oh, no! If the group gets it right, it means a 25% increase in the weekly budget for non-essential items. If they fail, the same amount will be taken from them. All right. Scan. Cut back. Over here. Yep. Where are you going, Giza? Oh, over there, right. OK, no, swing, swing that in. It's like a bloody shopping trolley. You never want to go the right way. Hey! Uh, Do a full half yeah. about. And a sec before right. you do that. It says it plug, in, plug in the power cable. Brill. Now we get to see what Hey, this is like. the only time we get to see each other on TV. On TV. Yeah. <laughs> and some have decided to dress up for the occasion. Yeah, I've got to go the little Boston. Peter, I'll just remind the others and yourself that before we start the test, get two incorrect answers collectively and you'll fail the test. All of us. Do you understand? Yes. Peter, who is scared of Roger the Rooster? That would be Blair. That's right! That is correct. What did you say? Roger the Rooster. What was that? Who is Gemma's choice for a famous mother? Gemma's would be her own mother because she's a superstar. Yeah. That is correct. What scares Sarah Marie? Sarah Marie is scared of not being able to breathe. Yes, yeah. three out of three, legend, that's it. That is correct. <laughs> is that it? Thank you, Peter. Send in Johnny. Will do. Which bit do you squeeze? <laughs> Question one, John. Yeah. Ben has how many siblings? Ben, Ben, Ben. None. Has how many siblings? None. Come on. None. That is correct. Ben, that is correct. Peter's favourite movie is what? Pulp Fiction. Oh, I think 
Peter's favourite movie. Ah. I'm going to have to think about this for. Pulp Fiction. Come on. Just give me a sec. Go to the next one. Come back. Vibes. Can we scream it? Yeah, the you can hear, they can hear you scream in there. They can. You, can hear, you can hear you scream when you get it right. Can you? <laughs> oh, no. Should we, should we hear that like Pulp Fiction? <laughs> Gladiator. That is incorrect. Ah. Oh. Which five housemates, which Madonna was their mother? Make friends, but something went horribly wrong. He broke their wood chopper, injured a housemate, and danced like it was the 80s. The cause will be out Sunday, and Todd could be in the firing line. Let the nominations begin. Andy is the last housemate to be tested. One mistake from her, and they lose. Andy, which five housemates, which Madonna was their mother? <sighs> Including myself, me, Peter, um, Christina, Johnny, and Blair. Yeah! That is correct. <laughs> what possession would Blair save from his home if it was burning down? His golf club. That is correct. We've done it. Yeah, we've won. What would Shana like to be renamed? Phil McCavity. You have been successful in your first week's challenge. While the housemates were celebrating, the chickens were being saturated. Blair and Sarah Marie decide to move them to higher ground. Hey, settle, 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 settle. Settle down. Come on, baby. Settle, settle. Yeah, hey, hang on. Hold the door open. Hang on. Hey? Hold the door open. Too. Dawn French. She's a comedian. She's married to black guy. Lenny Henry. Lenny Henry. Lenny Henry. Yeah. <laughs> she was in Absolutely Fabulous. She was in Absolutely Fabulous. Yeah. No, she's a writer. Yeah, 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 Dawn French and Francis Jennifer. Saunders. Yeah, Francis Saunders. Francis Saunders. That's right. That's Jennifer right. Phil. <laughs> Got a good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you scored. Good on you. <laughs> In your face. In your face. <laughs> Can't help myself. It's just so squeezable. It's too good. Yeah, should have said my bum instead of my legs. Sorry? Should have said my bum instead of my legs. Exactly. <laughs> Like, I'd be considered too big to be a model. They'd want you to be skinnier than me. You're kidding? No. Thinner than you? Yep. Loads thinner. Because I'm a size, I'm a size 8 to 10, but they want you just a size 8. Like, they want most, most not all of the time. It's, it's changing. It is, it is changing. But I've seen a lot of my friends, like, having beautiful, beautiful figures, like, really nice, healthy-looking size 8s or 10s, you know, so that they're, they're, they're slim, yeah. but they've still got shape, shape and they've still yeah. got meat on them to mm. going emaciated. Mm. Next on Big Brother. Day three. 
Yeah, I've um, I figured out a system on how to count the days and the dates. Well, we got in here on the 23rd. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I um, in my book. 23, I'll be back to 24, I'll be back to 25. Good work. I don't know what to do when I get to 30, though. <laughs> <laughs> I might go Just for... go back to one. I'll go back to one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's terrible. Oh, no. That is wrong. <laughs> No, I didn't mean it like that. What the problem I had was, yeah, I can't. You're not Joey, you're Phoebe. Yeah. <laughs> Ow! You'll be thrown no, out for violence. If I go back, if I go back to one night, <laughs> no, and I thought, oh, I'm gonna get stuck when I get back to 23 again because it's already cold and over. Oh, I'm terrible. How are you doing? <laughs> I thought you meant you fold each page over and then open it up again. I'm sorry? I thought you no, thought I mean, corners. Yeah, 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 that's yeah. What I mean, that's what I mean. yeah. But you're not holding 23 in place, are you? Oh, yeah, I've got them. I'm folding them over. Oh, what? oh yes, I don't need to do that. I don't need to do Here you go. Andy has decided to use Can the diary know? room as her personal diary. No one's following me now. <laughs> they locked me out. Huh? And it just, it just seems so amazing. Um, I'm starting to get the hots for Christina as well. <laughs> you know, I totally wasn't this afternoon, and now I am. She's not the only one craving company. There's so many things that I want to do, and I just don't. Why not? Yeah, because I'm on camera. Oh, I see what you mean. Were well, you embarrassed that people laugh at you? Yeah. Think you're silly. Maybe my parents are watching this. You know? But they know what you like. They've been to your whole life. Yeah, well, They know yeah. if you're silly and giggly or whatever you I don't know, whatever you... We haven't seen it yet, so I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I mean? Yeah. And my parents know I'm an idiot and blah, 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 crap and do all that sort of stuff, so... I don't think my parents know me that way. Mm. I don't know. Where are you this time? Um... Are you might be a problem. Well, I've been away for a long time. Well, this is their chance to get to know you. So... Um, it's pretty sad. I'm starting to get the house for everybody in the house. I guess because they're becoming my good friends and I was always the person who would have colourful friends, as I call them, colourful friends. Um, I think the expression they use in Australia is um, friends, friends with... friends with benefits.
that love we see blossoming in the Big Brother house? Or is everyone just after a fiddle-de-diddle? Are the two mutually exclusive? Now we have one couple, or maybe more, it's going to be increasingly difficult for the housemates to decide who to nominate for eviction. But decide they must, because starting this weekend, all the Big Brother housemates will go to the diary room, one by one, and nominate two other contestants for eviction. They give one person, the one they most want out of the house, two points, and the other one point. They are forbidden to discuss or reveal their votes to each other. The three contestants with the highest number of votes will be listed for eviction. And then it's your turn. You will decide who's out of the house. Over the coming week, the viewers of Big Brother will vote by phone and decide who's first to be kicked out. So join me this Sunday night at 7.30 on 10 for the Big Brother nomination special to see who the housemates put up for your vote. G'day, betters here. Catch more news and gossip from the Big Brother house with regular updates on Triple M or read about it in the Sunday Herald Sun. Big Brother.